hello everyone this is defense politics asia and uh this is the quick update over at the situation at kayamsky sector and particularly is the this uh, infamous town now petikaki and uh in case you can see the spelling yeah Peti petikaki so uh this petikaki is like you know the 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 the, the, the the disloyal girl that everybody wants and uh they just keep changing hands and keep changing hands and yeah so uh we have information uh f from the russian uh, side uh from russian defense ministry that there there is a uh, fighting a around this region here uh particularly the russians actually attack uh nearby kayamsky and uh, nearby lukove as the ukrainian forces uh were actually reinforcing and moving towards uh, lukove they got struck by uh, russian forces this happened uh on the 21st of june uh, over the past uh, 24 hours and uh the situation over at uh petikaki is uh particularly uh intriguing as i, as I said is the you know, is the girlfriend that you know everybody wants uh, that that everybody shouldn't want um so what happens is that after the russian forces uh, have recaptured petikaki um information from the russian uh pro-russian source raiba say that the ukrainians counter-attack again and they managed to capture petikaki again uh because the you, you the russian forces didn't really uh, uh, entrench themselves in petikaki and uh, as as they capture petikaki they immediately go straight for zeribianki uh so this happens and uh, however this area here is uh, actually is actually a russian uh, hit, uh defense line and uh this did not work out for the ukrainian forces and then the russian forces counterattack uh into petikaki and they actually captured it so information from Rybas uh reported this information that they counter attack and then they actually captured uh petikaki and so you no know, yeah so the russians captured petikaki right you no know, the ukrainians then counter attack again so uh they after the russian forces uh captured petikaki the ukrainians counter attack again uh and the russians run away again so they 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 didn't bother to stay and fight. The uh, Ukrainian forces uh, entered into Petikaki again. And uh, tentatively, the, the latest information we do have is that uh, uh, they they were... No uh, the latest information is from pro-Russian source saying that the Russian forces still uh, have control over uh, Petikaki. But I saw information from War Gonzo uh, saying that the Russian forces have withdrawn. From Piatikaki. Uh, but because I no longer use Wogonzo as uh, a source tentatively, I uh, just read about it. So uh, we will wait, we'll wait for information from uh, other trusted sources to you know, report this. And but it's just uh, hilarious how how this you know this town is just keep changing hands. Uh like you no know, it's like you, everybody wants it and don't want it at the same time. So anyway, this is the situation over at the the Kams Kayamske sector of the Zaporizhia front with uh ukrainian forces uh and the russian forces continue to trade hand uh trade hands in petikaki while the russian forces uh managed to uh ambush some of these ukrainian forces that is coming through kayamske towards lukove so uh yeah this is just a general picture and i'll see you in the next update